I started teaching uh, about shortly after I got a graduate school in the mid 80s. Yeah, so I was part time for probably about nine years and then I became full time at Parkland about 94, 95. I'm teaching students and that's, that's affecting them. They're going to look at things maybe a little bit different because what art does is it opens you up. You, it makes you aware, it makes you sensitive to the rest of the world. When you're making art, um, you're interpreting the world by uh, making things uh, through one of your senses. With what I do, I, I do that through teaching people to make form with their hands. And in the process of doing that, you, I, I believe you become more aware, more sensitive, more open to the world around you. I think you learn by doing. I think that idea of creative experimentation, not being, a, not being afraid to make mistakes, um, is one of the more important things I can leave students. The nice uh, thing about the place where I'm at, at a, at a community college, is you have this range of people creates a dynamic in the classroom which is really unique. It, it's, it's, it, they're, they're sort of like great chemicals forming compounds and they react and they, they uh, it, uh, make this thing, this, this classroom environment which is conducive to working. And um, that's really nice because a, a studio an open studio environment where people are working and they m might be working on similar techniques, but they're making their own language individually. That adds to a really interesting dynamic, and uh, I love seeing that happen. That you know that that keeps me going as a teacher. Art can take you places that nothing else can. As an artist, I make this thing. And I make this object, I'm an object maker, and my object maker can go across town at Cinema Gallery, the Parkland Art Gallery, and so there's a little piece of me that's alive, and it's out there, you know. Um, hopefully it resonates, and if I'm lucky, maybe it resonates with somebody, and then you share it with the rest of the world. And that's, that's just really, really amazing. I mean, that's, that's why I make art, and that's why I teach art.